Ladies and gentlemen, you are in for a special treat tonight. Born into a world where animals weren't thought to have personalities and women weren't accepted as scientists, a young Jane dreamt of animals and Africa. In July 1960, Jane Goodall, a 26-year-old English girl, has embarked on a remarkable adventure. This was the life I had always wished for. A curious girl became a world-renowned scientist. But the species and habitats Jane loved were under threat. It's become apparent that I have to use this power to help the creatures who have put me in a position to do just that. What began was a global fight that has inspired generations of scientists and activists. And on her 90th birthday, Jane is finally retiring. Good run, old gal. What? What's that? <laughs> Terribly sorry. Apparently on her 90th birthday, Jane shows absolutely no signs of slowing down. I have to run, I have to run. I'm traveling 300 days a year or more. I always give my tree a little kiss. But... They're almost back to where they were 100 years ago. I can't even begin to say how significant it is to live with Buffalo again. You I cannot help but understand how everything's interconnected. She started something, we are continuing it, and we do not want it to stop. This is why the Roots and Shoots program is so inspiring. It's easy to see the potential in making a massive impact. I'm an obstinate person. I'm not going to say no. I will continue fighting for what I know we can do. Each and every one of us matters. She's a catalyst that connects all of us. Together we can. Together we will save the world. Thank you. When people are talking about the theory of Mother Nature, I think she is what she is the mother nature. <laughs> and that just means this is me, this is Jane.